Imagine the juiciest secret you've ever heard and then add drama and characters to it. And some cheating spouses. It's, it's all in today's book. <laughs> Keep watching to find out what book we're talking about today on Kyla's Reading Day. Hey, my name is Kyla Denanyo and welcome to Kyla's Reading Day. So today we are talking about the book One of Us is Dead. This book is written by Geneva Rose and the genre of the book is fiction. The theme of the book is suspense thriller. But I would say that this is like a PG-13 suspense. The suspense was, it was, it certainly wasn't as suspenseful as other books that I've read. So let's get into some more details about it. One of the very important quotes in this book was, America was built on the backs of others. We're just carrying on the tradition. What, what do you do with that? <laughs> There's so much truth there. There's so much fear there. And that quote was from one of the nastiest characters in the book, a woman named Olivia. So the reason why that quote was important to me is because that quote was really indicative of the mood of a lot of the characters in the book. Right, so the book revolves around a hair salon and the Patreons that come to the hair salon and have their hair serviced, get waxes, get their nails done, all of this stuff. The class system was a really big part of this book. The book is based in Atlanta. There's a lot of money in Atlanta. There's a lot of old money in Atlanta. So there was also the issue of new money versus old money. So the book had a lot of depth to it and a lot of the characters all of the characters in the book were so intertwined. So let me just read out some of the names, right? So the main characters were Jenny, Crystal, Shannon, Bryce, Mark, etc. But it really was Jenny and her co-worker Keisha, Crystal and her husband Bryce, who was the ex-husband of Shannon, <laughs> Olivia and Dean, but Olivia was also sleeping with Mark, Karen and her husband Mark and Karen had a lover on the side. So all of the characters lives were intermeshed, intertwined and a, and a lot of, of messiness was going on. It was like Gossip Girls meets the Stepford Wives. That's the best way that I would explain it and it was a very very entertaining book. So it takes us right into point number seven which is would I reread this book? Yes. In fact, I've started to read more books by the author Geneva Rose just to see if she has this witty, really funny style in every book and I'm starting to see that she does. So that was today's discussion of One of Us is Dead. As I mentioned, the book revolves around a hair salon and let me tell you, as someone who waited more than two years to get my hair professionally done because of everything that was happening in the world and Man, I miss the gossip that goes down in hair salons. <laughs> I missed it. I missed it, but I was able to get a good dose of it when I read this book. So let me know if you've read anything by the author Geneva Rose or if you've read this book, One of Us is Dead. If you have any questions about the book, if you want to ask me any more questions, feel free to leave a comment. I will definitely write you back. So thank you for watching today's episode of Kyla's Reading Day and I will see you next week. Bye.